Thursday morning I woke up and my throat was on fire. I went to the health center, urgent care, um, and they told me I had an upper respiratory infection. Hey, what's up you guys? So as you notice, I am not at trails this weekend. I have an upper respiratory infection. My college roommate decides to put the window up when I'm asleep, allowing the cold air to come in, and now I am sick. I am on medication that does not let me drive a car regularly, yet alone a 4.5 second car in the eighth mile. So we just figured for safety concerns, and plus me being sick slows my reaction time if something were to happen. We just thought it would be best for me to stay here and be back and healthy and better than ever by next weekend for my last race of the season. I really wish I could be there, um, but given circumstances, I need to put myself first. So good luck Blaney. We wish you the best. Good morning, racers. It is a nice, cool fall morning here at National Trail Raceway. And we are here for our final points race. And unfortunately, it is just me. No Sarah. She couldn't make it. She felt a little under the weather. So she decided not to make the journey out to uh, trails. Although she really wanted to, we advised against it. So it's just me today. So, um, we're about to run our first time run. Blaine Basil to the lanes, Blaine Basil to the lanes. They want to call me specifically to the lanes on a time run. Um, so yeah, I think we might actually be late. Are we late? Yeah. So, speed it up. We got two time runs today. We're going to show them both before you see me again, but it'll just be me and the junior today. So let's see what we can do. So guys, we're back here after our two time runs and they were both pretty solid. First run, I was 69 on the tree and ran a 8.06. And then second time run, I was 35 on the tree and ran an 8.04. So we are currently rolling up to the lanes at the moment. So we'll see what we can do in round number one. Hopefully something good, right guys? Let's see what we can do. Hey guys, so we're back here after round number one and a disappointing result in round number one. We did not get the job done. Um, mess up on my part, I was down in 807, they were 791. I'm 50 on the tree, they're 80. Felt pretty good kick it a couple times and then uh, they did the old jump skip and hop and I couldn't catch it so I broke out there I ran 806 on my 807 they went dead on with a four and so I lost there which means I get to go into the losers race so we're about to go up for the first round of the losers race right now Hey guys, so after round one of the second chance race right there, um, we got the win. We weren't great on the tree. We were at 87. He was 84, so he actually got the jump on us. But his car slowed down two tenths. He ran an 860 on his 840 dial. So we were able to get around him pretty easy and get the win. So we ran an 816, uh, killing a tenth. So we're going up for round number two right now. So let's see what we can do.
Hey, what's up, you guys? So we're back here after round number two, and we got the win there. Um, I was I was 33 up front. Uh, my opponent was 005. Go down through there. They're way out in front of me, and so I just let them go. And they broke out. They went an 802 on their 806. I went an 807 on my 808. So we're we have the bye to the finals. So in very plain, typical fashion. We're going to run the bye run and then go straight into the final round. So let's see what we can do in the final round. guys so we're back here after the final round and um we did not get the job done it was a pretty tight race though uh let's see here let me look at the time slip so i'm gonna give you guys like a full full breakdown because there's a lot that's going on here so um i was dialed an 808 he was dialed a 797 we both take off i'm 43 on the tree he's 24 so i'm behind and so we go down through there um pretty sure i was ahead but i decided to do a jump skip hop i know i'm strongly against jump skipping and hopping when you're ahead but that's what i did and um i went an 808 with a two so i was dead on my dial with a two and they went a 799 with a one so all so for all of you math heads um 24 plus 21 equals 45 and 43 plus 2 equals 45 so it was all zeros down at the starting or at the finish line but they go to the fourth digit and i'm behind by three ten thousandths of a second so that's how much i lose by um hope you guys enjoyed the encyclopedia or the blaine explains that's a good segment not going right um, so that'll be it for today's video and um, so Yeah, there's the second chance race championship going on. I kind of don't want to win it, but at the same time I'm in first place in it because you know, I'm in the losers race so much so um, It's not locked up, but essentially um, If I lose first round tomorrow, which let's hope that doesn't happen then it's locked i'm locked up on the second chance points champion if not then the person in second has to win the second chance race in order to pass me so the odds of me winning the second chance championship are pretty high but there's still a chance that it couldn't be so with that being said that'll be it for today's video um, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys missed Sarah. I'm sure you guys are tired of me, for sure. Uh, she'll be back next weekend for the Halloween hoot out. But the next video you will see will be Sunday's action. So make sure you guys tune in to see what happens. And make sure you guys like, subscribe, do all that fun stuff with all the Facebook, Instagram channels that we have. Make sure you guys check out the reels that we have going on for both YouTube and um, Instagram. And along with Facebook. Facebook has reels too, I believe. So, with that being said, we'll see you guys next time. When I say we, I mean me because Sarah's not here. So, see ya.